So comfortable um, with a tow uh, cover, it does help with um, yeah, protection on your phone. Yeah, so the uh, ground is that sort of dewy, wet way, and uh, they're holding up fine, really good, comfy, uh, not letting in any water, which is the main thing, and uh, the grip on them's good, you know, so all in, like I say, Sports Direct. Um, Caramuir, I think that's how you pronounce it. Um, 27 quid. And they are what they say they are, which is waterproof, but they're breathable. Because my feet are not getting hot or overly uncomfortable. If anything, my feet are staying quite cool. I wouldn't say they were like, you know, warm and toasty. But that's the trade off when you get something that's breathable. Keeps your feet a bit cooler. But uh, certainly keeping it dry, which is uh, which is really good. Oh, here we go. Way up that way and see what I run. Oh, we're on a roll. A birdie roll with that colour. Heck yeah, you bet you it's getting wintry on the courses. Our greens are recovering from hollow corn and sanding, so although I've hold two birdie putts, they ain't putting well, I'll tell you. They're bumping everywhere. I've just been getting the bumps going the right way. The leaves, they're coming off, and the droves. Back there, I just had a six iron over the corner, Like I say, I'm hitting a lot of irons today, and uh, it's 
get a fuel back for them. Whew. A lot of hills in this course too. So I'm pleased that these shoes are as, uh, got as much traction and as comfortable. Uh, and like I say, they're, I could walk through a puddle quite comfortably and uh, I wouldn't be wet. So, oh, <laughs> catch my breath. I'm, uh, I'm happy, happy that uh, A, they're not leaking, B, they're comfy, and I think they look okay. Uh, stick in the comments what you think they look okay. Which I'm not saying they're golf shoes, but... Oh, that hell. Oh. Right, I passed. Passed out. Oh, 150 was back there, so I reckon I've got 130, 40 uphill and one slightly behind toying with you know, I don't think an 8 iron's daft, so I'm going with that Now I know what some of you are thinking, you know, the divot and uh, how the club went in there, but I kid you not, that is how much that ball was above my feet. So I'm standing down here, so I've got to do a lot of things, because I'm so low down, down the grip a wee bit, the blade is going to come in slightly open because it's on this slope. So you've got to allow for that, and you've got to try and feel the slope. So I could just feel that I was, you know, up here, and I knew I was going to have to come through like that a little. And normally you would probably draw it off. Another birdie pot. <sighs> We'll just set this up so you can see it. Hopefully get it, because that would be three, that would be good. Ah. Oh. Right. Oh. Show you it from the get-go. I've been keeping the pin in. So I'm just going to keep my pin in thing. I can't see the fixed one. I reckon my pitch mark is probably here somewhere, bounced on. This could go anywhere, hopefully in the hole though. Shows you, it. you get the, the odd bounce. Well, there you go, there's my pitch mark, so it's spun down there. You got some odd side spin, back spin. Don't really like this grip.
down the middle. Didn't really draw much, but I was trying to turn it. Still a chance to get to three under. Go to the seventh, this is the last one. Fantastic, but you've got to give the ball a bit of a clean because you can pick up sand when it's rolling. Put sand on the face as well. He's on fire. Yeah, you can get a lot of sand even getting on the check that and give it a wipe. And the uh, ball to three under. Like I say, greens are okay, but take three under. Could have been four under if we'd have got that one back there. Robbed with that bounce. Thanks for watching, hope you've enjoyed it. It was just a quick sort of turned out uh, seven holes. Managed to get to three under, so whew, quite chuffed with that. Channel's all for charity. Uh, Mac Millen, Help the Heroes and Shelter has been for ages. Uh, your sub subscription is really important though because, like everything, YouTube has things that say you have to get to a thousand subscribers. We're still a way off that, so monetization is not happening till we get there. So hopefully you've seen this, checked out some of the videos, and uh, it's helped you. And uh, you can hit drives, and some iron shots I've hit today. Butter's been, I think it's the ball, red hot. Thanks for watching.